This your boy Kilo on Save the Arts TV, and today we're going to talk about why you should support indie films. Let's go! The art of music. One reason why you should support indie films, number one, is the stories. You know, most of the stories that we see on the big screen, Hollywood screen with the $200 million budgets, all those stories had to pass through series of people. So sometimes the story get watered down, it's not as raw as we want, or some we might be missing some of the details that we like to see. And guess what? When a person is starting early in the basement, some of the best stories in the world come out the basement. And matter of fact, a lot of these big Hollywood producers all started off by being an indie filmmaker and making that raw material which got them the accolades in the first place. So that's one of the reasons why we always should support indie films and go out and check it out because some of the creative minds in that beginning stage when they first so hungry and want to get out there in the world, they come up with some amazing stuff. You know what I mean? Amazing. Number two. Number two. It's life changing. It's life changing for the youth. It's life changing for adults. How is that? Because a lot of people, we only sit back and we watch TV and we're like this. Dang, I sure wish I could be there on that TV. Dang, I wish I was in that movie. Dang, I wish I was uh, on that commercial right there. Dang, I wish that was me on TV. Dope. After shooting an independent film, we witnessed firsthand how when a person gets in front of that camera for that first time and they get to see themselves in that editing floor and then they get to see themselves on that big screen. Big screen. That, that big, big screen. screen. That thing changes lives, man. It make people look at themselves in a way they never even thought they could possibly see themselves. They see themselves now as not just being a regular person watching TV and watching movies all the time, spending their money, but they also see themselves as a person that could possibly get on the the and be a super duper celebrity. They see more in themselves after being a part of an independent film. It motivates kids. It motivates adults. It motivates the dog. The dog get on camera like, what's happening? It motivates everybody that becomes a part of it. Everybody that plays a role in an independent film feels so much better when it's done. So much better. Celebrity status. Three, one other thing it also does, it promotes community and local businesses. Most independent films, we don't have the big budgets to go and get the big studio background. So what we have to use is our real life community. So we go to our business owners and we say, hey, can I use your hair salon? Hey, can I use your bakery? Hey, can I use your car wash? And we shoot it right there. And then we say, you know what? Just for letting me use this business, I'm going to put your name and your business right across my big screen, my hundred foot screen in the theater. You're going to see your business name go across that hundred foot screen in the theater. Yeah, dig? And, and the business owner says, hey, that's marketing and promotion for me. Dog, let's do this. Let's do it. Let's do it together. I support you. You support me. Let's do it. Do it back and forth. Let's get in love. Let's get in love. So that's a beautiful thing. Help promote businesses. Help promote community. You know, it shows grandma sitting on the porch like, what y'all doing? Police pull up on you like this. Nobody shooting or nothing. Oh, y'all filming. Just stay filming. Even the crossing guard get in the picture like, hey. <laughs> Number four, it transforms amateurs to pros. For most of y'all who want to be in those big films and y'all going to meet that big producer who did that big film, the first thing he's going to ask you is what have you been in before? So if you haven't been in any independent projects, any independent films, and you ain't build your resume up to show them that you're ready for that pro status level, they're going to know it and you're going to miss an opportunity. So if you could get into some independent films and put your name, build your resume, get your pictures taken, like ch -ch 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 -ch. it's only going to help you. You know what I'm saying? It's only going to help your career and all that good stuff. So make sure that you get in the indie films. Tyler Perry said, don't despise small beginnings. Let that sink in. Number five, the memories and the friendships that you gain while creating these products are priceless. We all went to high school. We was in a school with about 300, 400 different kids. And guess what? We probably remember a good 100 of them. And especially when you get an adult, only thing you remember is the lunch y'all had, who fought who, who was the best dressed, who was the prettiest, who was the star athletes and stuff like that. Now you have an opportunity as an adult to meet more adults and create these bonds that are lasting. And the children that's in films, same thing. When they meet other kids, they, you know, they share their little Instagram with each other and little Skypes or whatever social media they're using. But now they become friends or associates for life. 
from that one project. You call on certain people, they'll call you, give you leads. Hey, bro, hey, bro, they auditioning for such and such. Hey, sis, you need to try to come down here and get in this play. You need to try to come and get in this movie. Stuff like that, those relationships, they last forever. So that is very important. The memories and the relationship. Number six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, the one thing that I definitely want to say, and I'm going to end it on this note. We are the first line of inspiration. Boom. You can't go on a Hollywood set and pull up and say, hey, can we just watch Will Smith and them shoot this film? We just want to stand and watch. What? Oh, get out. Oh, my bad. <laughs> we want to stand and watch y'all shoot this new Terminator film. We want to stand and watch. Huh? Oh, we can't be here? Oh. No, you cannot stand and watch these big $200 million budget films. You can't be on the property while they film it. But with an independent film, you can stand, watch, and even ask questions and be inspired. You understand? Be inspired. So we are the first line of inspiration. Basement. You can't build a house without the foundation. All right? So just know independent filmmakers are the foundation for actors, for cinematographers, for editors, for people to just be inspired and believe that they can because Hollywood ain't going to give you no opportunity if you didn't take this opportunity first. first. And support your independent films. They need help. They need help when it comes to equipment, when it comes to even having lunch on the set. You know what I mean? When it comes to renting out a theater to show their movie, they need help. Buy some popcorn when you're there. Buy some nachos. They need help, they need assistance, and guess what? Remember, they won't be small and indie forever. Bam, bam. Say the Arts Say the Arts TV. You know what it means. Say the Arts TV. Let's go!